Okay, so another day, 19th of January, bit tipsy last night, had a kebab, fell asleep with a kebab and a Leica catalogue, didn't even realise I went to sleep, just woke up this morning, just woke up literally 30 minutes ago. I was really hoping that I would upload a video last night, but the internet wasn't connecting at all, and 3G, rubbish here. I've just got off at Frankfurt Airport. Took the shuttle bus from Light Park, but I won't be flying today because I'm staying one night in Frankfurt. So I've booked into this place called the 25 Hours Hotel by Levi's, the actual Levi's, and I'm this room number. Lucky number for Levi's. Not for me though, because that's not my room number. <laughs> Morning. Good morning. Hello. Ooh, funky. Hello. I stay for one night, my editing suite. I have actually booked myself a mini as well, it's free with this hotel, but I noticed something downstairs, which I think I might take instead. Somebody in the comments section asked the other day if I have a real job. <laughs> I get what you mean. I get asked the same thing by relatives all the time. Is that your real job? The simple answer is yes, this is my real job. Just finishing off the edit and having a little bit of dinner as well. So, so glad to have an internet. It's brilliant. <laughs> I've been living in the dark ages for the last night. At least I can finish off the edit and upload it. Actually upload it, hopefully, if all goes to plan. Let's have a potato. Yes, that's right. Tomorrow I'm flying out to Asia for a two-day job. Could have gone back to UK for one night, but figured that it makes more sense just to stay here. Saves time and energy. Can finish the edit, publish it tonight, hopefully. And tomorrow I fly out. Save one hour on the plane. Great. Okay, I messed up big time. Fell asleep last night editing. Last night, this morning, 5.30. Um, woke up. Time is 10.05, I need to be flying at 12.10. Let's go. Time, luckily it's only 15 minutes to the airport. <sighs> Made it. Okay, where am I going? Oh wow, Jesus has a shop here. You know what, I've just arrived in Hong Kong. That guy's got his underpants on the outside of his trousers. Time to charge my phone. 
Dunbar and Tank was always shit anyway. It's better to watch your luggage being stolen. Oh, hold on a minute. I can't actually show you the next bits yet because I was in Hong Kong on a paid assignment for DJI. I will show you my stuff when they show you their stuff. So yeah, Hong Kong was paid work, Germany was not, although travel and stay were covered. Thank you, Leica. But anyway, rewind. This is my real job. Content creating, whether it's paid or not. When I was taken to Uber to Hong Kong airport, I got talking to the driver and it turns out he's a photographer. He's been doing it since the 80s. These days it's a lot tougher for him, with loads of people with digital cameras charging less, there's less opportunities, and clients want to pay less. Hence why he's driving people around in the middle of the night, to supplement the job he wants to do. You know, it's no different for me and Locke, we've just started our own channel, so understandably we're not making much money right now, which is why Locke has gone to work for Dan Chung at Photo Gear News, and I'll be doing something with a company. CVP that me and Dan Chong hang out at, play video games from Dan Zero to get free drinks, but mainly to play with a ridiculous amount of video gear in their demo space. I make videos about photography and tech. They want me to make videos about gear used for making videos for them. But the key thing is they want to keep supporting what I'm doing here on my channel, which is why I'm doing collab project with CVP and I'm super happy and excited and grateful for it. It keeps me doing the job that I love doing most if you can call it a real job. Props to Jackie Cheng, the guy who wants to keep the dream alive. Asian bye. <laughs>